Hey everybody, this is Paul, 125 Roller Coaster Challenge, and I am at my 17th park of the year, Conneaut Lake Park. So I just uh, got permission to walk through. I can't drive through, but I can walk through. And I definitely want to uh, show you this park. So as you know, Conneaut Lake's been uh, pretty much in the uh, news uh, with the coastal world when they got rid of Blue Streak. And uh, from there, they have a new owner. And uh, you know, he's been opening things up slowly and stuff like that. So I want to basically show everybody uh, What's going on at Connie Lake Park? So we're gonna to explore together because I have no idea what's going on here. But I did get permission from somebody in the golf cart and I'm gonna take that as I can actually come back here. So you look back here. So here's the whole back area of the park. And the first thing you come across here is this little kid's ride here, which is kind of cool. Um, like I said, I don't know what the history of this park is going to be. I know we were here six years ago and we rode uh, Blue Streak and it was kind of sketchy. Uh, like I said, this park has gone through bankruptcy a couple thousand times. But let's check it out together see all the stuff here. Now here's a little dipper. I never did get this coaster credit. Um, and I don't know if I ever will now. But uh, let's check it out. Let's go. Let me go over here real quick because we're at the far end of the park. So I'm not sure um, if you know this park better than I do. Let me know what was back here. Because like I said, right there is a kid's car ride. And over here is... Uh, Looks like a lot of benches and stuff, but this is Little Dipper right here. And uh, yeah, the track doesn't look like it's in great shape, but they actually do have the trains. So right there's the lift hill, had a lot of little bunny hills. Looks like this would be one of those ones that kind of knocked you on your butt when you went flying through it. But there's the logo, Little Dipper. And let's go check out the train. So this is the definition of an explore video here. Oh, check these out. This is the original trains. Really cool. So there you go, that's a little dipper. Now it looks like this was like the main kids section. Uh, I remember when we came here, there's a lot of activity uh, and you see a lot of pods on the ground here. Uh, I kind of feel like I'm walking through Geauga Lake uh, pretty much uh, when that was all closed down. But like I said, the guy gave me permission. So I'm going to say the guy with the dog in the golf cart so I can come in. So uh, you guys got my back, right? All right, we're all set. So here's a, uh, a dizzy drum type ride. That was here. So the drums look like they're in okay shape. And over here, that looks like a uh, old prize booth. But really, you could tell at one point there's a lot of kids attractions right in this section that are no longer there. Here's a gazebo. Uh, now I'm going to pop over to this side because I did notice over here they have uh, an old, um, I call them rodeos because I'm from Hershey Park area. But I'll come over here and check this out. Now if you like these kind of videos, make sure you hit the like button. And if you know anything about uh, the new Conneaut Lake Park, please let me know in the comments. Uh, I'm definitely interested to learn more and more. So, but here is an old, uh, I think they're roundabouts. Uh, if you know the name of these type of rides, please let me know in the comment section. Now this one definitely needs a paint job, but it looks like it's still operational. The tires look pretty new, but actually right here, the Tilt and Whirl looks pretty new. Um, pretty impressed with actually the Tilt and Whirl here. This guy seems to be in really good shape. Uh, no real rust. Uh, I mean, paint job looks pretty good. So if you check it out there, so the Tilt and Whirl looks pretty good. And now we're coming over here. That was a snack booth. I remember that. That was an old snack booth. Now this, I think, is the Devil's Den that everybody talks about. Uh, and I guess it, at one point it was a coaster credit. Let me uh, get a little bit more light there. Because there's actually a, a car in there. Yep, stick it to the devil. So this is actually pretty cool. Before he sticks you. I love that slogan there. So this is definitely a ride that I know a lot of people like to see uh, come back. Just because of the fact that these are... Uh, very rare. But that's the Devil's Den. Now over here is looks like a main arcade there, but over there, look, there's a Crayola box, which is really neat. It's a Crayola box. And over here, this is go-karts. So it looks like the go-kart tracks look like they're in really good shape. Let me uh, line it up a little bit here for you. And the Tiki Bar parking's this way. Now, I know the Tiki Bar is actually a big thing here. So that's always uh, very impressive. But these are the go-karts. I parked over there by the hotel. 
because uh, I remember that aspect. Uh, I know I was here years ago uh, with a girl I was dating, and then uh, I came here about six years ago uh, with Devin uh, to get the uh, Blue Streak um, creds and stuff like that. Now this, I believe, is the bumper cars. Yes, it was the bumper cars. So I still remember some of it. And this is a kind of neat little thing here. And then back there is actually uh, what's left of Blue Streak. So the Blue Streak train thing was here. So that's what's left of Blue Streak. There's a the bench there. But uh, like I said, I know a lot of people were very upset about Blue Streak. I actually was not one of those people. I thought that um, it, it would have taken a lot of more money for them to actually fix it than it was for uh, the worth. Now over here is a ride that looks like it's good to go. I mean, literally, it looks like it's like ready to go. It's called the Octopus. So that one looks like he's in great shape. Now it looks kind of almost like a spider that, uh, it looks like it's a spider, but it actually looks like it's almost brand new. So um, unlike a lot of the other things around here, uh, the only other thing that looks like it's in good shape is the, uh, uh, I will go with the uh, golf carts. And the Tillamore looked pretty good there, but the octopus looks really good. I'm actually impressed with the octopus. So that looks like it's in good shape. And I'll walk down here over by the midway. And then we'll start walking back, see what else there is. But if you're watching this, uh, looks like you like what we do. So make sure you like this video. Um, basically, uh, help that really helps us out. And uh, if you're new to what we do here at 125 Roller Coaster Challenge, consider subscribing. Uh, it's a simple click for you, but it means a lot to us. And I've um, always been uh, a fan to get more and more subscribers. We drop new videos every day. All right, so here is the Blue Streak Spud Shop. So Blue Streak's gone, but that sign looks really, uh, looks actually pretty darn good. Looks like you can open it up right now. That might actually be our thumbnail there, people. And over here is a mini golf course. And I always like mini golf. So that's a mini golf course right there. And that looks fairly new. And over there, there's one more thing that I want to get a picture of. And then we can call it a day. But this is the new Conneaut Lake Park. I'm hoping that the mini golf really uh, takes off. Uh, it's called Cascade Express Mini Golf. 18 holes. And there's restrooms, I believe. And then over here, there's one last thing, which was the, uh, I actually have no idea what the ride this is. If you know what this ride was over here, uh, please let me know uh, in the comment section. But it uh, looks like it's definitely overgrown. And it looks like we're coming to the end of the park park. So once again, I want to thank you for watching. Uh, this was a spur of the moment. I am counting this as number 17 because I did go to the park. And uh, it's not my fault the park's not really here, but um, definitely uh, check it out. And once again, thank you so much for watching us explore Conneaut Lake Park 2023.